various locations around L.A. County, just the start of things. Main event, strong Santa Ana's. It could see sustained wind gusts of 50 miles an hour or more expected to blow into the region on Saturday night. Combine those with heavy winds with five years of droughts, it spells some pretty bad news for our trees. Michael Green is an arborist for Evergreen Arborist Consultants out of L.A., and he joins us live. Uh, Mr. Green, what kind of tree conditions have you been seeing recently, and how much of this is tied to the drought? Hi, Bob and Chris. Thanks so much for having me. Uh, you know, some of the things I've seen, the effects of the, uh, the drought, is that it's created an environment uh, for insects to thrive and attack and injure and kill trees. So, uh, you know, two examples I've seen specifically towards pine trees is uh, the bark beetle and also uh, various uh, species of uh, the polygamous shot hole borer. And so, you know, if things have uh, attacked the trees and, you know, can cause it to uh, go into decline. So if we do see, say, 50-mile-per-hour winds or possibly yeah. even stronger this weekend, how bad could it be for our trees? You know, it, it, that's a pretty strong wind. You know, generally, uh, you know, any winds that are about 35, 40 miles an hour uh, can injure uh, or topple trees that are good or bad. So, you know, one of the things that's important to have your trees, I know it's pretty short notice, but it's important to have your trees inspected by an ISA, International Society of Aboriginal Cultural Certified Arborist, and they can go and look for things such as pruning their branches, uh, and they'll know uh, not to top your trees. So it's it's also just things to look out for that. You know, a lot of people would uh, think that uh, they want to counteract all of this by you know watering their trees and watering them a lot. But well, I guess we're being told that, that really can cause problems too, right? Yeah, and so um, in my experience in um, Southern California, um, you know, I've seen a lot of trees actually overwater. So. You know, yes, we do want to give our, our trees some um, supplemental water, but um, I've actually seen a lot of overwatering, and that can actually contribute uh, to trees uh, being toppled over, uh, even if you have a wind. So, yeah, the tree might be unhealthy, but because you've been overwatering and the, the soil is so moist, it, the tree uh, can fall from the, due to a soil failure as well. So. Okay, Michael Green, thank you. Uh, Michael Green is an arborist for Evergreen Arborist Consultants based here in Los Angeles. It's 11.54. So, can the Dodgers drop their magic number to two?